To create this design, you need to add circle with the 24 words. Then go to the edit mode, select everything and press F to fill the gap. Then use the insert operation. Then select these words and press J to connect them. Then select these faces and delete these faces. Select this edge loop and E to extrude it and move it along the Y axis. Then select this face and move it along the Z axis in this way. Select this edge loop and E to extrude it and move it along the Z axis. Then add one loop cut here and then press Alt S and scale it along the normal. Then Control B and add bevel on it in this way. So you can get a curve form add there. Then select this face, use the insert operation, press B to over the border. And then E to extrude it and move it along the Z axis. Then select this face and delete it. Then select this edge loop and press F to fill the gap. Then shift A, mesh, add a cube. And this is our cutter object. Give it a position here. Go to the edit mode, turn on the extra mode, select these words, move them along the X axis and then scale them along the Y axis. Scale it down a little bit and give the position here. Ctrl A, apply the scale, go to the edit mode, select this edges and Ctrl B, add bevel on it. And add a two segment bevel. Adjust the position here like this. Then select these two objects and shift Q use the boolean operation difference. Select this object, go to the edit mode, select this bottom edge loop and press F to fill the gap. So you can see, you will get this kind of block out. Then select this object and apply the boolean modifier. And delete this cutter object. Then select these edges and Ctrl B add bevel on them. Add one segment bevel. And press C to avoid the overlapping. In this way. Select everything, press M and merge by distance so double words will get merged. And now we need to create right tuple launcher here. Select these words and merge at last. Then use the knife tool and create one cut like this. Then create cuts like this. Then select these words and merge at last. Then select this edge loop and control B add bevel on it. Add one segment bevel. Turn on this loop slide. So you are going to get proper edges. Use the knife tool and create cut along the X axis. Then select this edge loop and control B add bevel on it. Add a two segment bevel and shift factor should be one. Then select this bottom edge loop and control B add bevel on it. Then select these edge loops and then control B add bevel on it. Then select this face, use the insert operation. Use the insert operation one more time. And then select these words and merge at the center. Dissolve this edge. And now we need to create right topology here. So use the knife tool and create cuts along the Z axis. Select everything, mesh and cement, try to take the symmetry. Select these words and press J to connect them. Add a loop cut here. Now we need to create topology here at the bottom side. We can select these words and press J to connect them. Then create cut along the Z axis. Add one loop cut here. And then hit the control 2 and add the sub D modifier. I'm facing difficulty here. Select everything, mesh and symmetry, stick the symmetry. You can modify this topology. Create cut like this. Then select everything, mesh and symmetry, stick the symmetry. So you will get chord based topology here. And there you go. In this way you can create this kind of design. You can see the form and you can see the topology. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching. If you like this tutorial, then hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Bye bye. See you next video.
take care.